been a very big week off the field, hasn't it? Uh, the AFL's announced a new drug code. That's right. And it goes something like this. could have been seriously hurt, uh, but luckily for him, when he hit the ground, his airbag went off. <laughs> a Collingwood supporter, a moron, and a doll bludger walk into a bar. And that was just the first bloke. <laughs> uh, so here's a new innovation. It's the Velcro membership card from Richmond. <laughs> so you can cut your heart, cut in half, and then you can still get to the game the following week. <laughs> Jess Sinclair came out and said uh, that uh, the boys like to call Dean Ladley their coach Bible because he's so hard to read. It's quite a coincidence. Uh, Sam used to be called the Bible. Is that right? Uh, yeah, they'd always find him in cheap motels. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, I've actually got my own copy of the Collingwood Encyclopedia. There it is. It's the a good Collingwood book. Encyclopedia. It is a good book. I was actually given uh, this uh, by the cops because I had my house burgled, they wanted me to look through and see if I recognised anyone. <laughs>is it easier is it becoming a little bit uh, more readily available for players to take drugs like ecstasy yeah well the clubs got right onto it i know they first became suspicious during the uh, when the boys were singing the club song when some of the players turned out the lights and danced to it <laughs> they're not on the real we're world we're all marching out of step with you they probably are uh, just about lost interest in this as well i can't have the rest of the night on right. trip i think the problem is ed when he bought his new face it was negatively geared <laughs>